Hey, good morning, everybody. Just out here and uh, thought I'd give you a quick update on Swamp Donkey. A little more orange has been laid down. And I mean down everywhere. My shop is orange now. But uh, got the rear tub painted. Did all the rest of the top cap there the other night. It's looking good. We got our seam seal all done around the wheel wells. Ready for line X. I just got one more thing to do. Cut a hole here so I can run a motorcycle coil over shock for my seat spring. I weigh in at about 21 stone, so regular seat springs aren't doing the job. Look up 21 stone. There's your homework. It's a unit of measurement. Anyway, I only got a couple little pieces left to paint. Uh, I got to make some side kick panels to get rid of all the holes from the original hardware. Uh, I figure at the end here, where am I? Here. Uh, I'm going to curve it to match the arc of the, the engine pulley. And on the other far side, I'll do the same thing. It'll match uh, with the pull start. But uh, footboards are all welded in. I got to get rid of the grip tape so I can finish uh, the paint and everything on the footboards. Uh, as I said, the back of the bed, and I think these panels here are all going to get done with the line X. Um, that's about it so far. Hasn't been a lot going on. This is my busy time of year with the snow plow and it's just getting going. So uh, I don't get as much shop time as I'd like. And with the cold temperatures, it takes half the day just to get this place warmed up enough to want to do anything out here. But uh, I think the next little project, once I get the rear tub done, is uh, installing this. It's going to bolt in under here off that one inch tube. It's the lock assembly off a Chinese scooter for the under seat storage. And it comes with a regular lock like your car door would have. So the lock is going to get installed in the side panel on the other side there. And I've got the keys and everything. So uh, you'll need a key to open the hood. High security? Not really. But it's something uh, I haven't seen anybody else do and I thought hey why not? It's outside the box. Um, just something different. Anyway, other than making sure I paint the rest of my shop orange with the rest of the bits I gotta do yet uh, we're getting closer mechanically I gotta make a, a foot pedal I wasn't happy with the bicycle brake setup I mean it was quick and dirty it did the job but uh, I'm gonna make something more permanent something custom uh, hydraulic brake upgrade is still in the works. Uh, I'm still collecting bits and pieces for that. I'll be making a video when I get down to that time. What else? Oh, the exhaust that I can't, I can't stand it. I threw that together so quick and dirty with a piece of pipe that I had laying around. Oh, I hate it. It's got to go. Um, I have a plan for that too. Stainless flex pipe. I'm going to eliminate this whole section here right from the manifold back to the the main exhaust pipe. I'm just going to run this stainless flex. Uh, it'll look way better, cleaner, and uh, flow a little nicer. But anyway, I don't know what else to tell you other than uh, I'll soon be making my templates so that I can cut out all my wood grain panels for the the rear end here. Uh, that's about it. Like I say, I've been busy doing other things, life, and so here we are. But uh, hopefully here I get some time to knock out some more progress. 
I'll try and keep you guys posted as we go. Anyway, thanks for coming along. Hope you liked it. Let me know in the comments uh, if there's anything you'd like to see in particular. I'll try and look after it for you. You guys have an awesome day. Bye for now.